Another example, Mr. Fatih does not like Wahhabism and he does not like the founder of Wahhabism, Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab. So what does he do? He connects the great uh, Indian scholar Shah Waliullah with Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab. He says on page 49, Shah Waliullah left India for Arabia to perform the pilgrimage of Hajj and during his two years in Hijaz and Najd came in contact with Wahhab and joined forces with him. So Shah Waliullah joined forces with Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab. In, uh, in page 49, in page 50, he goes on to say, Shah Waliullah was his disciple. Aside from the fact that there's absolutely no historical proof that they even met, let's take Mr. Fateh's words on this. According to you, Mr. Fateh, Shah Waliullah left for India in 1732. This, this is what he says in his book in page 50. And according to you, Mr. Fateh, Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab started his militant reformist movement in 1744. Now the question is, how could Shah Waliullah join forces with Abdul Wahhab 12 years later when according to you, he was not even in the country? He was not even in the region. He gives another meaning to distant learning. He says on page 49, Shah Waliullah left India for Arabia to perform the pilgrimage of Hajj and during his two years in Hijaz and Najd came in contact with Wahhab and joined forces with him. So Shah Waliullah joined forces with Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab. In, uh, in page 49, in page 50 he goes on to say Shah Waliullah was his disciple. Aside from the fact that there's absolutely no historical proof that they even met, let's take Mr. Fateh's words on this. According to you, Mr. Fateh, Shah Waliullah left for India in 1732. This, this is what he says in his book in page 50. And according to you, Mr. Fateh, Muhammad bin Abdul Wahhab started his militant reformist movement in 1744. Now the question is, how could Shah Waliullah join forces with Abdul Wahhab 12 years later when according to you, he was not even in the country? He was not even in the region. He gives another meaning to distant learning.